All right, this is the Aquion circulation pump model 700. And basically, if you're looking to cause movement, water movement in your in your aquarium water, or if you're looking for a device that will circulate your water well, then this pump is the pump for you. So basically, it comes with an instruction manual that comes in three languages, in English, Spanish, and French. And basically, it explains to you how to, you know, where to install it, how to install it properly, things like that. And it also comes with the unit fully installed in packaging and one thing I gotta say about this is it's very very well you know built and it also comes with a suction cup locking feature a pivot and the the cowling is removable as well so if you ever wanted to take it off and clean it you can so basically this is my 29 gallon cichlid tank and I thought to myself that it was kind of dull as far as water movement goes and usually always get um basically like sediment build up in the corners of the tank and so i was like why not install this pump to try to move those those sediments around and keep the water more clean because whenever you move the sediment around it causes the the sediment eventually it's going to find your filter inlet and get sucked up and the water is going to get filtered better and so i decided to get this pump it was on sale i picked it up so Basically, this is installing it. So you have a locking feature and a suction cup. So the way you install this, that locking feature to, to install it, it's gonna be in this up position right here. And you're gonna put it directly into the water like so. And you want the wire facing up so that when you're so, so that when you're done installing it, the wire had the, the, that you get the maximum length of the wire that you, the, that it that it's not obstructed or blocked by anything else. And so when you're installing this, you want to press the suction cup against the against any any given side of the tank that you're installing it, and you want to make sure that the locking that that the lock has enough room so that you can clamp it down. And once you clamp it down, it's able to move slightly, but you have to drag it against the glass and also make sure that the mating surfaces are clean. So if there's any algae in the place that you're going to mount it, please make sure that you clean the algae, or else it's not going to be it's not gonna stick so it's connected here's the plug and on it goes so as you can see this is what it looks like when it runs and I like the effects the little shimmer effects that it did to the water because at that time you know it causes the the ceiling and underneath to look more to, to it basically makes them makes it look like they're in their natural habitat the water has movement to it like they're actually in Lake Malawi or that they're in the ocean or wherever they live you know it's Malawi cichlid so it is what it is but overall you're causing surface agitation will allow oxygen to reach to reach deeper in the water than it would with just the filter running by itself and alongside that if you have any food or any waste or uneaten anything uneaten in the tank things would reach different things would be able to reach the filter inlet better so that they can get picked up and filtered but overall I I like the way it made the tank look it kept the tank a lot more cleaner than just having the filter installed and this thing also comes with an energy saving motor so it uses about three and a half watts of power so you're gonna be saving energy and it's not as as wasteful as the larger units so pretty much I that's about it and you know if you're ever looking for this it's available all over the place it's available online it's available in store and usually most of the big box pet stores that that carry um aquion products it comes in several sizes it comes in the 500 the 700 the 950 the 1200 the 1250 and the 1650 those are all from tank sizes ranging from 20 gallons to 180 gallons so they get quite powerful so you know, pretty much that's going to wrap it up for this video, guys. Um, If you guys have any suggestions for any future videos, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'll try to do my best to accommodate you guys and, tell you, and you know, help you guys, you know, find some, for find new products for your aquariums. So, if anything, without further ado, um, I'm out, guys, and happy fish keeping.